A hydrogen-powered train has travelled on Britain's rail network for the first time ever, reaching speeds of up to 50 miles an hour. It's called the Hydroflex. It's a prototype uh, made a 25-mile round trip in Warwickshire, all producing zero emissions, would you believe? Our transport correspondent Tom Burridge was one of those on board. A 20-mile hydrogen-powered round trip and a first for UK Rail. Here we are, UK main line between Evesham and Longmaston, running on completely clean, green electricity. Hydrogen fuel cell and battery. It's a massive moment. On board, hydrogen is mixed with oxygen to produce electricity to power the motors. Having trains that can run on hydrogen power means they can run where there aren't overhead wires, there isn't electricity available. We can run trains that emit zero emissions. This is a prototype so its maximum speed is about 50 miles an hour. It takes most of a day to fill up its hydrogen tanks on board and then it can travel about 100 miles. Well, the challenge now is to get all of this equipment underneath the train so we can have passengers inside and run on the service. The aim is for paying passengers to travel on trains like this one by the end of next year. The project has the government's backing. The hope with this is to get it up to 200 miles at a normal uh, line speed and, um, and, and you know, getting all the infrastructure in place will be important. And that's the broader challenge, having enough hydrogen available to power trains in the future and ensuring that the hydrogen itself is sourced in a sustainable way. Tom Burridge, BBC News in Warwickshire.